light does not love me at all just look at me oh hideous anyway i have arrived in my hostel uh i like it mm, it's it's a very simple place it's just like a normal dorm room with you can see behind me there are like uh the double decker beds and yeah that's mostly all there is to it but it's very clean and very I don't know, fresh and homely, and everyone gets their own fun, which is the thing with dorm rooms. Especially if you're in a place as humid as Malaysia, you do not want there to be shared aircon or like shared fans because sometimes some people are like, oh, it's bringing too much cold. Some people are like, no, it's too hot, let's add the aircon. And for example, for me, I hate aircon. Aircon just makes me feel so cold. It makes me freeze. I'd rather even I'd rather be stuck in the humidity than just that crazy as feeling that aircon gives me. So if we had to share air conditioning, it would be really bad. Anyway, the room is really clean. I'm gonna show you guys in a minute. And been given my little Wi-Fi password. What stuck out when I first entered is that it smells very fresh, it smells very clean and there is nobody else here which I am so happy about. I am so happy about the fact that there is no one else here honestly. And it's really really close to the beach. I hear the beach is just like behind here. I could see the beach when, when I was in the cab coming so it's a good thing. So let me give you guys a tour of my dorm room. to the beach I've been told it's like a two three minute walk I just go straight on this road so yeah that's what I'm doing this guy was just like the beach is just here I am seeing a winding road now but let's just follow it and see what's up And we're down we go oh, 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 we're down. So guys apparently I took the wrong route. I was supposed to go left I went straight But this guy they honestly the the guy at the hostel told me just go straight use the main road that goes straight So I went straight and it was wrong he should have told me uh, just get out and go left. So now I'm going back there, then I go left. <sighs> okay, it's still light, so I'm still hopeful that I am catching that sunset. Yeah, I can see the hostel now. So now I need to take the left instead of going left. Oh, yeah, I was even wondering how come there are no people on the road if no one else going. So yeah, there I can see people. You guys, I have just entered in a beach resort that I have not stayed at. Just trying to like find a shortcut to the beach. I don't know if it's allowed. I don't know if I'm supposed to be here. But I am going. And I am going to. Oh, I hope I don't get caught if it's illegal. I don't know if it's illegal or illegal. I can just see people's rooms and I'm just like freaking out. Because I can see people entering their rooms. Oh, 
für uns. which I have ever seen according to me but I am going to Zanzibar soon so let's see look at those eye bags you guys I woke up at 4 a.m. for some reason I don't know I just found myself awake and it was so weird and where down we go Uh, 
you're alone, it's just kind of, you know, if you're with someone in color who are black, let me just say it, black, you just kind of, even if people are staring at you, you're just probably like lost in conversation or like talking to each other so you don't really notice it. But when you're alone, it's kind of weird. <laughs> but it's okay. Like, I'm still happy, I'm still enjoying it. Nothing, nothing shakes me. Just it gets me through.